In the dark and gritty city of Gotham, chaos reigns as the Joker, a psychotic criminal mastermind, begins terrorizing the citizens. The city's only hope lies in the hands of Batman, the caped crusader who fights crime from the shadows. In the Dark Knight, 2008, directed by Christopher Nolan, the battle between good and evil reaches new heights. The story opens with a bank robbery orchestrated by the Joker, leaving a trail of dead bodies and chaos in his wake. Batman, played by Christian Bale, arrives on the scene, determined to bring justice to Gotham. As the Joker's reign of terror escalates, he offers a deal to the city's criminals, kill Batman or be killed. This fuels a wave of crime and uncertainty, pushing Gotham to the brink of collapse. Meanwhile, Bruce Wayne, Batman's alter ego, struggles with his dual identity and the sacrifices he must make to protect his city. He forms an unlikely alliance with District Attorney Harvey Dent, played by Aaron Eckhart, and Lieutenant James Gordon, portrayed by Gary Oldman. Together, they hope to dismantle the Joker's criminal empire and restore peace to Gotham. As the Joker's twisted plans unfold, he targets the city's most influential figures. He captures Dent, Rachel Dawes, Bruce Wayne's love interest and a close friend of Dent, and several other hostages, holding them captive in different locations. Batman races against time to save them, even as he battles his own internal demons. In a thrilling sequence, Batman confronts the Joker in a high-rise building, but the Joker manages to escape, leaving Batman with a grim realization the Joker cannot be defeated through conventional means. Desperate to put an end to the madness, Batman resorts to drastic measures, using surveillance technology to track the Joker's movements. This decision raises ethical concerns and divides the city, as some view Batman as a necessary evil, while others see him as a vigilante gone too far. In a climactic sequence, Batman discovers the Joker's plan to unleash chaos on two ferries filled with innocent civilians. One ferry carries regular citizens, while the other holds convicted criminals. The Joker gives each ferry the choice to blow up the other in order to save themselves. As the tension mounts, neither fairy can bring themselves to commit mass murder, defying the Joker's expectations. Meanwhile, Batman and Gordon locate the Joker's hideout and rescue Dent and Rachel, but tragedy strikes as Dent, scarred and driven mad by his ordeal, seeks vengeance. Adopting the persona of Two-Face, Dent embarks on a personal vendetta against those he deems responsible for his suffering, including Batman and Gordon. The city descends into anarchy as Batman faces off against Two-Face atop a building. Batman manages to save Gordon's life, but Dent loses his grip and falls to his death. Batman takes the blame for Dent's crimes, sacrificing his own reputation to preserve Dent's image as a symbol of hope for Gotham. In the aftermath, Batman goes into hiding, allowing Gotham to rebuild and move forward. Gordon, aware of Batman's sacrifice, destroys the bat signal as a symbol of closure. However, a glimmer of hope remains as a new hero emerges in Gotham, carrying on Batman's legacy. The Dark Knight is a gripping tale of darkness and redemption, exploring the blurred lines between heroism and vigilantism. It delves deep into the psyche of its characters and poses thought-provoking questions about morality and sacrifice. With its thrilling action sequences, stellar performances, and complex narrative, the film solidified itself as a modern masterpiece, leaving a lasting impact on both the superhero genre and cinema as a whole.